All right, we're here on the south side of Des Moines at stop number five on our tenderloin tour at Smitty's. They've been serving up tenderloins on the south side for 70 years, and they make their tenderloins and onion rings fresh every morning. Emily, what do you get when you play tug of war with a pig? I don't know. A pork t No, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> Not a pork cup. Pulled pork. Oh, that makes <laughs> sense. That makes sense. <laughs> All right, so the first thing I noticed as soon as they brought this one out was how fresh it looked. You could tell both the onion rings and the tenderloins looked like they were made not very long ago. Fresh, daily, the breading on it is a lot lighter than some of the other ones. Yeah, um, like it's, it's like a lighter color. Lighter color, so I'm guessing it's different than what we've experienced in the past. It's super thin, so super different than the last one that we saw. Super thin, this one came with a lot of condiments on it. So this one has onions, mustard, pickles, and ketchup already served on it. So I think you can get it other ways, but that's how we have ours, so should we? I'm gonna add a little extra ketchup. All right, now it's time for the first bite. First bite, ready? okay. Classic. Classic. Does not get any more classic than this. I love the pickles. I'm a big fan of the pickle on the tender one. Honestly, we're talking about greasy ones versus non-greasy ones. It's probably the least the greasy least, one we've had. The least greasy one. But still has flavor, a lot of flavor, and it's not dry. Really flavorful, crispy, and I like it that it's thin. It's not as hard to eat. Well, we have to try the onion rings. They make those fresh every day too. So I'm a big onion ring girl. They're like kind of, they're almost like shoestring onion rings, but they're still the size of a regular onion ring. I'm bummed I didn't get a milkshake. I should have ordered a milkshake. Okay, I say this every time, but I'm gonna give it a 9.5, which is different oh than the other two 9.5s I've given, because the first one was white, and that was just a whole nother different kind of tenderloin. The other one was Smokey D's, and I think that was more of like a barbecue vibe. Yeah. This one is 9.5 classic, awesome. I don't know what would make it a 10. I just haven't given a 10 yet. <laughs> a 10 would be, I don't even know. Like I'd have to hear angels. I gotta think on this one. We gotta cut this right now. I think I'm gonna match your nine and a half. This is just a classic, Smitty's being a classic tenderloin. Just the texture, the non-greasiness, the pickles, the mustard, which I guess maybe it's not equal because I didn't put mustard on any other ones. Nine and a half is my ranking. Definitely recommend these guys. Come check them out here on the south side of Des Moines and get the tenderloins. And after this, I'm probably getting a milkshake because I bet they're really good. So get one of those two if you come out here. Um, otherwise. Otherwise, we'll see you at our next stop on our tour. Whoa!